Yo, right, lads, Mr. FIFA Gaming 95 here, back with episode 2 of I Want to Be a Millionaire. And I've been doing some more gold player trading, lads. I'm just going to take you through the play we've got. So you can see we've got 187,000, which means we've spent around 180k on these players. So I'll just take you through who we bought. So, the first player we have is an informed totter, a centre mid, 4 3 2 1. He's usually a centre forward or a striker, I'm not sure. And I picked him up for 20,000. And I'm going to try and put him up for 27,000 first, just to see if we can get that. Next one we have is Inform DOR, or Inform 22, picked up at 20,000. Hopefully, we'll be able to get around 24k for him. Just see. Then we have an Inform Felmy left mid, Inform 231, picked up for 13,500. Should be able to get about a few k profit on him. Then we have an inform who bought for 15k, hoping we can get around 20k for him. <coughs> How about that? And then the next player we have is inform the new inform Coutinho, but I don't think I did very well on this. I just checked his price, and he, he was at like 27k when I checked, but when I thought, when I last time I checked, but then when I checked after I bought him, he's only about 20k again, so I'm just going to put him up for 22k, so I'll try and not lose any money on him. Next player we have is Frank Lampard in 4222. Picked up for 39k. Hoping I can get around 44k for him. Next player we have Drog. This was a really good deal. Let's pick up a 4122. Didier Drog, bro, for 34,250. This was on the 59th minute, this one, lads. And I'm hoping I can get around 43k for him. Which is a good 6k profit. And probably the best deal of the episode, lads. Was Javier Pastore, centre mid 433, pick up a 6.8k, and I'm sure I'll be able to get around 15,000 for him. Oh, I'm gonna go to Rubinho. I don't think I'll get not a good deal. I'll probably small for 12.5k centre mid, but I'm not too sure about that. <sighs> one pad sold, one pad sold for 44k, lads, which means we've made 3k on that. Don't know why he sold so quick. Checking last night, there was one on for 53,000 buying now, so, but at least he sold. Next thing we got is this 4411 picked up for 1.1k. Should be able to sell for about 1,800. Yeah. Then we have 451, about 400, should be able to sell for 850. Yeah, 850. And formation cards are really good. Lads, if you not if you don't know how to trade formation cards, if you look on my road to 250k, a few of the earlier episodes there I show you how to trade the formation cards and really helpful. You made quite a long way doing it. And then I picked up two three four. Oh, drug was sold as well, lads. This is really good. Drug was sold as well, lads, I'm quite happy with that because I saw it. 53k, so what I've made about 7k in the I'm quite happy with that because I saw a drug run for 42,000 last night in 4 and 2 and 2, but really good that. So, on them two, we've made 10k already on them two players, lads. So, I'll be back once the rest of them are sold, and I'll be here for now, lads. I'm back now, lads, and as you can see, we have 401,000 coins. So, I'll just take you through the, what the players all sold for. So, first of all, we have Totte who sold for 25,500 and we bought him for around 20,500 so that's about 4k profit there then we have Diawara sold for 25,000 he was again bought for about 20,000 so it's another 4k profit we have Bellamy not much profit on this only about 1,000 pound profit but every little helps really but could have done better on that Hoof again not a brilliant bit like Bellamy only a 1.5k profit then we've got Lampard, who you guys probably already seen from the first part, sold for 44k. Bought him for 39, so it's about 3, 4k profit. Drogba, you probably saw as well, because he sold really quickly, sold for 43,000. There was about 6, 7k profit on that. Then we have Pastore, which is a really good deal, sold for 15,000. And when and I, made, I think so, I think I made about 8k on that. And when you only put 6k into play and you can make 8k profit, that's really good, that. Then Rubinho, not much happened to him. Sold him for 13,500, so basically barely made any profit on that. And then the next player we have is, and the next card we have is 4411, sold for 1.8k, it's about 500. And the 4, 5, 1, we doubled our money on that. And the 4, 3, 4, 1, 2, 
both sold for 400 which is a profit of 250 coins and then there was one more Coutinho where's he mm, one sec I'm just going to try and find what Coutinho sold for lads uh, and as you can see there Coutinho sold for 21,250 which isn't really a profit we just didn't lose anything on him so we're on 400 we've ended up on 400k lads and I'm just going to show you the total profits in that now lads Okay, so here, lads, you can see the total spent which, that I spent on the players, which is 184,100 coins, and all the players sold for a combined total of 223,950 coins, which left me a total profit after the 5% EA tax of 28,600 coins. So I hope you, that's, that'll be it for this episode now, lads. I hope you enjoyed it. You can leave a like and subscribe. Don't forget to check out my road 250k that I did before this episode, if you've not before this series, if you've not already seen it. So that'll be all for now. I'll see you next time for episode three.